Among the former French colonies in Africa, Niger has emerged as a nation resolute in its decision to sever all connections and associations with France. Recent developments indicate a significant point of contention between the two countries. According to information from the Agency for the Safety of Air Navigation in Africa and Madagascar, Niger's military leaders have implemented a ban on French aircraft from traversing the country's airspace. In a statement issued late on Saturday, it was announced that Niger's airspace is now accessible to all national and international commercial flights, except those bearing French affiliation or chartered by France, including those operated by Air France. The airspace will remain inaccessible to all military operational and special flights unless prior authorization is obtained. Earlier, Niger had reopened its airspace for commercial flights on September 4th, after a closure of nearly a month. The initial closure was in response to the risk of intervention from neighboring nations, following the economic community of West African states' threat of military intervention to reinstate the democratically elected President Mohamed Bazoum, who was ousted in a coup on July 26. France and Niger have historically had robust relations marked by numerous agreements, including cultural, legal, and defense cooperation. However, relations between Paris and Niamey have reached their lowest point since the coup. The coup in Niger is particularly painful for France, given its efforts to establish a unique partnership with Niger and make it a central hub for France's presence in the region. Initially, French President Emmanuel Macron declined to withdraw the French ambassador and troops from Niger following the junta's demand for their expulsion. He asserted that he did not recognize the junta as legitimate leaders and therefore disregarded their requests. However, in the face of citizen protests, disruptions to the water and food supply to the embassy and the arrest of the French ambassador, France has ultimately yielded to the pressure and opted to recall its ambassador and troops. The determination of Niger to distance itself from France raises questions about the underlying reasons fueling this decision. Share your thoughts on why you think Niger is taking such a firm stance in the comments section. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share and subscribe to our channel for more exciting future videos.